Hello Plymouth, my name is Luke Pard, I'm one of the campaign coordinators here at Plymouth Labour. Uh, today we're having our final meeting of the Open Manifesto process. Over the last couple of months we've been collecting ideas from right across the city about how Labour, if we're re-elected in May, can make the council fairer, greener, nicer, and have those benefits pass through right across the city. We've been collecting ideas from leaflet drops, from doorstep conversations, from phone canvassing, from our online survey, and from many other community groups and organisations right across the city. And we put it now into our draft manifesto. There's 51 pledges in our manifesto, and today we'll be discussing which one of those should make it through to the final manifesto. As the councillor and candidate for Devonport, I'm really pleased that the last manifesto meeting is being held in Devonport because our manifesto is about engaging communities, not just members of the Labour Party, but ordinary members of the community. And that's why I'm so glad that we're holding it in the centre of Devonport, the best community in the city. <laughs> so in 2012, we made 100 promises. We did 99 of 100. In 2014, we made 50 promises, delivered all 50. Now we're working on our 2016 manifesto. Really exciting. We listen to you, we listen to party members, and by joining together, we know what you want, we're going to promise to deliver it, and we will deliver it. You can help by canvassing and delivering leaflets. Go to PlymouthLabour.org and find out more about how you can volunteer your time to help Labour win in May. You can also help by making a small donation. Every pound that we raise all comes from volunteers. That helps pay for the leaflets and for the canvassing that we need. And you can make a difference by voting. If you don't have a postal vote yet, go to the Plymouth City Council website and apply for a postal vote. It makes voting so much easier and every single vote counts. Yay!